Hello everybody. Uh, I get a lot of questions about uh, aluminium air battery. Uh, one of questions was can I make some or can I show uh, how to make some high voltage aluminium air battery. So aluminium air battery have the voltage uh, of 1.2 volts and is made from uh, carbon for the uh, positive electrode the negative electrode is aluminium and the electrolyte is some alkaline based electrolyte so this type of battery uh, have really really good uh, capacity but the voltage is only 1.2 volts so I will try to make some high voltage uh, aluminium air battery uh, and yeah let's start the project uh, so for this project you need some aluminium for the negative electrode uh, of course you need also some um, uh, positive electrode which is uh, graphite 4 for the active material you need carbon, activated carbon, uh, some polymer separator. This I take from uh, lithium ion batteries, and also you need two types of electrolyte. You need some base, uh, some alkaline electrolyte uh, on the negative electrode, and some acid electrolyte in the positive electrolyte uh, in the positive uh, electrode so for this experiment I will use potassium hydroxide for the negative electrode and sulfuric, sulfuric acid uh, for the positive electrode here I have some tissue paper soaked in uh, potassium hydroxide the potassium hydroxide is made uh, 2 to 3 grams uh, of potassium hydroxide and um, 20 milliliters of water. Uh, the tissue paper will only set the electrolyte in place. So on the top I will put some uh, polymer separator, this tissue paper was, was soaked in sulfuric acid. Uh, so this sulfuric acid electrolyte was made by 20 milliliters of water and uh, 5 to 10 milliliters of sulfuric acid. So also you need some activated Carbon. So the voltage of this dual electrolyte uh, aluminium air battery is about 2 volts and is much better like normal uh, alumini aluminium air battery which produce 1.2 volts. So I will repeat myself the design of this battery. So on the top you have positive electrode which is uh, graphite 4. Uh, the active material is activated carbon. The electrolyte for this positive for cathodic section is some acid electrolyte. In my case is this sulfuric acid. The, the separator is used from lithium ion batteries and is polymer uh, separator. On the bottom is anodic side 
I have here aluminium for the negative electrode and uh, the electrolyte uh, for the negative section is some base, uh, I mean some uh, alkaline electrolyte. In my case is this uh, potassium hydroxide. pH difference make the voltage boost. You see, you have two volts. It's really easy to make. Also, you can um, experiment with concentrations. Uh, instead of using sulfuric acid, which is really dangerous, and uh, really pure sulfuric acid is really hard to get. You can also make some magnesium sulfate. You can try also phosphoric acid. Uh, your own research and you will find your best solution. Uh, maybe you can get over these two words, but Yes, I know, uh, aluminium battery can produce over 3 volts. Uh, I will use also some LED. Here I have my red LED. Oh. And the LED lights very very strong so we cannot see here on camera but it's really strong so I will connect this You see, you can get really easy high voltage aluminum air battery. So in this case, this aluminum air battery is also flexible. If you're interest, interested in flexible batteries. But this battery is primary battery. And this battery you cannot recharge. If you're interested in this technology, I will also show you how to make a solid state uh, high voltage aluminium air battery. But in this case, this section of this video will be uh, available only on Patreon. If you have some interest to make a solid state uh, high, uh, high voltage aluminium air battery, please go to my Patreon and you will find this project. Uh, so thank you guys for watching, we see us in the next video and bye.